What's up, nail friends, and welcome to the vlog. It is Halloween and I am filling orders instead of doing this tomorrow because <clears throat> I have something going on tomorrow so I want to be available for that. So I'm going to fill all the orders today and some other things that are going on is we're waiting for that glitter bells order. So that could come anytime when that comes. I'm going to film a vlog like an opening of that and I'm going to put it away and I have ordered everything we're out of so everything you guys need so metal files gel brushes acrylic brushes the unbelievable gel brushes like the new ones um the new gel unbelievable gel the new blooming gel uh hollow top coat precious top coat regular top coat glass slippers snowdrops white all the colors that we're out of all the gels that we're out of so we'll be fully we'll stocked up if you guys don't want to miss out on anything make sure that you sign up on the website um there's a pop-up that comes up I will link it, show you guys what that looks like, and then link to the shop down below. And if you sign up your email, we'll let you guys know when new product is in. And you could be first to get it and make sure you don't miss out on any colors that you were waiting for. Okay, so I got my pick list here, and we're gonna go through this. I was gone for a bit and Mark went and grabbed some stuff. I just put Teddy down for a nap. I have to grab this. This is one of the collections. Anyways, today is Halloween like I mentioned earlier. And Teddy is going to be a strawberry. A pink strawberry. <laughs> We're not doing anything for Halloween. But my dad's gonna come over and see him in his costume. <laughs> Okay, I'm putting together a manual order for one of my ambassadors. And then I'm gonna fill that um, right away for her. Oh, 
Tiny storage. of the princess collection then. Okay, so I gotta put these away. Put Teddy down and he's awake and crying. Let's see works in there. I'm gonna put him back to sleep. Ugh, that's the worst. And you just get them down and then they wake up. Good morning, friends. Uh, I didn't get everything done that I wanted to. I have lots of orders to work on. And my father-in-law is coming today, so that's great. So hopefully I can get him to help me in some way. Pack and pop.
Teddy's having like the best nap ever right now. I'm so jealous. <laughs> I wish I could nap that good. I feel like I might have jinxed myself. You should never say that while he's sleeping. He hasn't woken up yet, but who knows? I'm just gonna print out more of the orders and write a list of what needs. Mark says we're out of violet, 250 milliliter, but it says we have a whole case. Also, it said we had a whole case of um, the white top coat, and we also didn't, so I don't know how we mixed that up. Yeah, so, I said the other day on my YouTube community tab that my friend Jenny is coming. If you guys remember Jenny, she has the nicest girl in the world. Anyways, Jenny is coming next week, and I'm going to do a gel manicure on her perfect, amazing nails. Um, and I asked you guys what you guys wanted to see. If you wanted to see a luminary gel mani or if you wanted to see a glitter balls gel mani. Looks like more people are saying a glitter balls gel mani. Also, I've done a ton of luminary gel manicures on her, so I will link that gel manicure playlist in my description box for you guys to check out. But anyways, what kind of design should I do on her nails? It'll be in next week, so like November. It's not going to be quite Christmas. But maybe I could do something kind of festive or I could do something festive and then not post it till Christmas. I don't know. What do you guys think? What should I do? I'm not sure. <laughs> Anyways, got some uh, orders here to do. Later today, if I can, I'm gonna put away all these boxes. So cold. I gotta finish. Um, some orders here. on and it's still so cold there's like it doesn't even feel like I have it on Packing Pop is here helping us because the dryer is broken. He is here fixing it. So I don't know if he's really going to be in the vlog because he's fixing the dryer. He's just out getting parts right now. So I'll try to get him to come say hi to you guys if I can remember. Hello. Hello. It's Packing Pop. Packing Pop. Packing Pop. 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 Pack and Pop. He fixes Pack and Pop dryer. fixes my dryer. It's a, I'm dryer daddy today. Dry. Oh. So a package came in the mail. It's another TikTok made me buy it. Let's look at it. Okay, so I found this on TikTok, of course, like I said. The girl's page is called Camel Glow, and I will definitely share some of the videos. Anyway, she has amazing hair and awesome hair, hair, hair care tips. So I thought I would order something that she uses. Let me share it with you guys. This is the bag. So this is like a hair curling system that you can use uh, without heat which is what she does to her hair. So this is what it comes. And I think she probably has instructions. Yep, there's instructions. So anyways, I'm gonna try this tonight and I'll show you guys how this turns out tomorrow. So with the magic of editing, ding. I know that transition didn't match because dark out. It is like 6 a.m. This is how my hair turned out with that heatless curls. I didn't do any extra curling or anything. I got up, took them out, and this is how my hair is. It's pretty, it's kind of like a 
fluffy little curls. So I didn't have my silky, like I have this like silky head thing I wear. I wore this for like 10 hours or something. And then Theodore kept grabbing my hair. But every time I kept getting up to like put him back down, he would like grab on it. And I was like, oh no, he's gonna ruin my curls or pull them out. It still turned out pretty cute. So I'm gonna use this a couple more times. So you guys will, oh, I'm gonna start using this always because heatless curls, why not? 10 out of 10. I'll definitely share the link to the website and this girl's TikTok because she has hair goals, like serious, serious hair goals. And she offers tons of advice on how to grow your hair and how to take good care of it. So definitely check her out. Um, I am super busy today and I have a time crunch. That's why I'm starting at like six. So I don't know if I'm gonna eat, even vlog today because I have way too much to do and like vlogging takes time <laughs> and I have a time crunch. So maybe I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh my god, look at all the clean boxes. I told you if I did so if I left something long enough, Mark would do it. <laughs> this is the second time I've used this. The first time I did it, I just kind of threw it in. Messy. It turned out cute, but this time I did it on damp hair and I actually like brushed some of the pieces going into the wrap. I also put my hair in a like silky thing to keep it from getting too messy. And I just put this clip in because um, I wanted this out of my face. But this is what it looks like without a clip. Hey guys, I got to change the sales section. So I thought I'd show you guys how I do that in, in Shopify. So I clicked more filters, collection, scroll down to sales, and then I'm clicking all 24 that are in here. So I have to change these all back to their original price and then put them back into their old collection. So I remove them from the collections that they're in because I reduce the price and I don't want people to be able to use codes on the already greatly reduced price. So here I am just removing the prices and changing the old prices back to nothing at the compare at price. So I'm just quickly doing that and then I will save all these at once. Then I go into the sales section and I refresh and I double check that everything has been saved. I noticed that it hadn't so I just went back. Now all 24 products are saved and I refresh our page and I see that all the prices are back to normal. So now I can remove these from the collections that they're in. So you don't wanna remove them before change of the prices or you might get confused. So here I'm going in, I'm picking all the colored acrylics first. I'm clicking them one by one, there was only six. And then I'm going to add to collections. So I'm going to add these to the color collection, colored acrylic collection and then I'm going to do that for all the other products as well. The premix glitters, I'm going to add them back to the premix glitters and the gel, I'm going to add it back to the gel. After you've added all the collections back to where they should be, then you can remove them. So I'm just going to click them all, remove from collection, scroll down to sale and then save that. And that will just remove them all from the sale section. So now I'm going back into collections and I'm going to look through and go and pick the loose glitter. So I decided to go in here and pick out some of the colors that I had um, numerous amounts of and some of the ones that I was filming earlier in the video for the TikTok and I'm going to put those ones on sale. After you add all the products into the sales section, you want to make sure to also remove them from the sections that they were in. So I just go ahead and click each one. So if it was loose glitter, gel polish, you don't have to do it individually, just click all the ones. Then I go in and change the prices to the lower price that I decided to do. So I went in and I decided to go and add colored acrylic and premix glitter to this, as well as I added tips. I decided not to do gel polish for this sales section. 
again after they've been removed already from the collections that they were in that's when I go in and change the prices to the new sales prices and you want to keep the compare at price so that it'll to let everyone know what the sale price is and then I save that so after that I went on the website and I took a look at what everything looked like and I didn't really like the way some of the pictures looked so I'm just gonna crop them a little bit smaller just so that the um, uh, swatch looks a little bigger and brighter so I just did that on a couple of the sale section colors so I kind of just do that every once in a while I'm not gonna do it on every single color to click photo but just on the ones in the sale section and after that was all done I double checked how everything looked on the website and I sent out an email so if you guys want to see more tips and tricks on my Shopify information and stuff like that let me know down below okay so I'm gonna end the vlog you guys saw that the sales section is updated. Also make sure you sign up on our website and the pop-up that comes up so that you're notified when our giant order it comes in. I'll if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe and click the bell next to it to be notified. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.